Hi, my name is Astrid Sisa and I work at the Cancer Registry of Norway. I would like to introduce our paper entitled Children and Young Adults with Parents with Cancer, a population-based study where we attempt to count and describe the children in Norway who has encountered parental cancer. We do this both as a prevalence count, i.e. how many children under the age of 18 and 25 has ever encountered cancer in a parent, and also provide incidences for the number afflicted annually. We also describe the social demographic characteristics of the children, parents, and families affected. We also provide the disease-specific characteristics of parents. And lastly, we provide risk estimates for the probability of the, these children to experience parental death compared to children in the general Norwegian population. We believe that information of this kind is vital for healthcare initiatives aimed towards those potentially adversely affected as knowledge of who these children and families are is a prerequisite for assessing and responding to their needs. We find that each year around 0.3% of all families with under 8 children in Norway encounters parental cancer and that at any one point in time 3.1% of children under 18 years old and 8.4% of young adults 19 to 25 years old have a parent who once has been diagnosed with cancer. This corresponds to a population prevalence of 1.4%. Skin, breast, and colorectal cancers are most commonly experienced. Around one in, fi one in five of these children experience parental death. Losing a father in cancer is more common than losing a mother. And children with parents with leukemia, brain, colorectal, and lung tumors most often experience parental death. It is therefore important that surveys of live respondents account for this for the large proportion of children having experienced parental death. Thank you.